So I saw in your video you said that you are a Christian. I am, yeah. And what is a Christian? What is a Christian? A follower of Christ. And you follow Christ? I do. A and how do you do that? How do I do that? Yeah. By submitting to his word. Um, no, obviously I'm not perfect, but I believe the things that, he, that Jesus taught, and I want to show the world that as well. And I gave my life um, up to him. So it's his to command and follow. Um, there's obviously a lot more of being a Christian, you know, action, <laughs> fr fruit, so many things. But uh, how yeah. has it helped you to be a Christian? How has what helped me? Yeah. How has it helped you to be a Christian? Um, honestly, when you're living right and not uh, following the sin continuously, when you're actually a Christian that wants to live right for Christ, there's a lot of peace um, for you. Um, even though there's things going on around the world and negative things and I'm not saying there's never, never ups and downs, but like, there's been a lot of peace and, um, and I just kind of feel like you're doing what you're supposed to be doing. Like God, he designed you the way he did. And so when you're living for him, it's like, even if you're not great, you're better than you could be. Um, and I want, there's, I want people to know his love. You know, I've experienced how, how good he is through my life. Do you have um, perfect peace? What was that? Do you have perfect peace? Do I have, uh, that's the goal. <laughs> <laughs> so do you have it? Uh, do I have perfect peace? It's a good, I've never been asked that before. I mean, I have the Prince of Peace. <laughs> who follows, who, who what, follows. what does that mean? I have the Prince of Peace. Uh, God, you know, God is the Prince of Peace, Jesus. Um, but I don't know if I, if it's something accessible to me, I am working on that. <laughs> <laughs> Do you believe it's possible to have perfect peace while you live on earth? Um, that's a good question. I'm, I feel like yes, but then I don't know. Yes. I, I think I'm going to say, uh, <laughs> Do you believe that, has God ever answered your prayers? Yeah. He has answered your prayers before? Yeah. <clears throat> can you, without getting into your personal life, can you give me a, an example of a prayer that God answered for you? Um, I mean, this is kind of <laughs> small, I guess, but I, I used to work at Costco, and <laughs> I remember I was working the, the night shift really late. I got out at 11 every night and I, you know, they, within the company, they have jobs you can apply for. And I remember praying to God that I could get this position in major sales. Cause at the time I was a night merch and major sales, instead of getting off at 11, the latest you would get off is nine o'clock. And I was like, if I get off nine, that means I'll show up a little bit late, but I can still make it to the young adult service that I wanted to go to on Thursdays. And I remember I was like, if I could just switch that up, that would be so nice. So I remember praying to God, God, please, I want this position. They put a position up for that um, department. And so I started praying and asking God. And I didn't, they actually offered the job to someone else. And then I was like, dang, well, I prayed. This is so unfortunate. And then like a week later, the, the general manager of the of the of that Costco came up to me and said, do you still want to work in this department? And I said, yes, I do. And within like a week or two, uh, I was transferred to that position. It was a moment where I was like, dang, God didn't answer it. And then a week <laughs> later, he did. <laughs> And do you believe that, um, and so you said, you call Jesus, would you say Prince of Peace? Yeah. What does that mean? He's, well, you know what peace is, um, and I guess he's the prince of it, but he's also the creator of all everything. So I guess he'd be the prince over everything. <laughs> <laughs> and so what does the prince do? I don't understand the prince part. What does that mean? I think it's just in the scripture that they say that he's the prince of peace. Um, uh, if I'm not mistaken, <laughs> I'm not a theologian by any means, but I definitely, um, <laughs> I'm the best 